Uh, guess what? <laughs> uh, our graduate students actually there because I'm not. Uh, I don't have graduate students any longer. Uh, their graduate students heard that uh, my colleagues cannot uh, cannot go out and collect uh, <coughs> collect beetles uh, today, and they decided to help us, I suppose. And uh, since they heard it so late, it was kind of late to catch uh, stag beetles, but they were still able to secure many Japanese beetles. So they got four. Uh, four stag beetles and listen to this they did a very good job because they got one very common species and three uh, species you know uh, three stag beetles that belongs to a not rare but currently rare <laughs> by that what I mean is currently the field is dominated by this guy and these three guys belongs to minority species so they got four stag beetles three minority species. They did a very good job. I'm impressed. And <laughs> here we go. <laughs> this is the familiar species and all these three small ones. These are different species. Okay, anyway, so four stag beetles. And listen to this. When they heard it, it was past midnight. So it was, <coughs> it was too late to get <coughs> um, stag beetles, as I keep saying, but it was not late to get <laughs> Japanese beetles. So they, they decided to get many Japanese beetles, and they were told by my colleagues that, uh, you know, a couple of days ago, was it yesterday? Yesterday, maybe. They got 21 stag beetles, and uh, my grad students decided to beat it, and uh, they got 23. I haven't counted it, but I'll take their word for it. Uh, they got 23 um, stag beetles, and I, I don't bother opening it because they'll certainly <laughs> fly away. Uh, can you see it? 23 Japanese—I mean, 23 Japanese beetles and four stag beetles, three minority species. Minority at this point. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> again, <laughs> four stag beetles and. 23 Japanese beetles. That's incredible. <laughs> See it.